next segment, Folklore and Fairy Tales, we'll be delving into a region where a lot of the mystical folklore tales have originated from, Germany. Now before we get into the more famous tales, like the Tales of Grimm, we will be delving into one of my more favorite obscure stories. This tale comes from the outdoor forest near Schwedwald. This boogeyman tale is known by local scholars and villagers as Kobel de Grotte, or Goblin of the Grotte. It is said that the spook was either a creature, spirit, or man old warlock lived in the forest or caves in the mountains of the region, which gives it the Grotto name. This myth says that the creature would steal wandering children out of the forest at night and bring it into his cave of death, as it was called, and turn the children into dust, like everything else in its domain. The most frightening and probably my favorite part of this tale is the goblin's staff. It is what allowed him to perform his black magic rituals. The staff was also rumored to have a small glass orb allowed him to trap his victim's souls inside and save them for later. The story itself has never been researched to any large extent due to its relative obscurity. There's only been one village in Germany that's ever reported sightings of the goblin. It is in my personal opinion that there never was a goblin, and that the burnt areas of the outdoor forest can be explained due to the superheated hot springs that are all over the area. Germany has a large but unknown history with volcanic activity. During the time period where this story was created, misunderstood or unexplained events were often attributed to the supernatural or magical forces. However, misunderstood stories often create the best tales.